everyone, it's Phoenix here, and today I'm going to bring you a tutorial on the threshold effect, which you might have seen if you've been on my other channel, uh, channel sorry, I can't speak, it's called Trail of the Phoenix, and I upload montage edits on there. This is what it looks like. Um, hopefully you can see that, because my recording thingy is quite laggy sometimes. Um, if not, I'll slide through it slowly. Basically, a black screen, and it comes out. Uh, the shape that you want comes out with a white outline, like that. And then, if you go on, you can do it with like the whole scene. If I can get it to the right point. Like that, sort of, and it just sort of whitens in. Uh, I'll show you how to do it. I've already got a, um... Sorry, my mind's gone back today. Uh, what's it called? A comp? That's it. Yeah, it helps if I knew what I was saying. A comp in here with the clip that I want to use. And I'm going to right click, once i found the place where I want to put it in, go to time, go to freeze frame. There. Now, I'm going to take my pen tool and I am going to mask out the bit of the thing I want which is going to be the gun I won't show you how to do it all because it's basically the same for everything I'll just show you how to do like one bit instead of the whole scene if you want to do that I'll mask it out roughly because it's just a tutorial so it goes roughly like this do it like this for now, it's easier. Yeah, you can take more time over it. Um, just keep going. Yeah, um, for my other channel, I'll provide a link in the description and I'll show you the, the, the bit of the clip at the end that I'm talking about. Out where it all comes in, and I, so you can see what it looks like properly without having it lagging. Um, don't need to do this bit, but well. All right, that's just it roughly. It's not an amazing one. I'm gonna feather it just a bit with about three, just to make sure, and go over to effects, right click, go to stylize and threshold, I think it was 255, yeah okay, so at the start I'm going to keyframe it at 255 and then I think I'm going to go on about a second and one second in it's going to go to zero which makes it all white. It's basically all it does is just sort of fade in bit by bit and then obviously you can change the position by going to position putting the position where you want it there and then say trying to back in I know putting it over here so it comes in while it's fading in like that if you can see that and then obviously like on my other thing you can like on this one you can do it with um other things as well and then you can do like a sort of like camera wobble and stuff to make it seem a bit more um, edgy and stuff like that but that's really the basics pretty simple um i hope you like the tutorial um Please comment in, on any of my videos if you see an effect that you like and you want me to make a tutorial on, and I'll try my best to do it. Thank you for watching, and subscribe if you like it, please, and subscribe to my other channel as well if you like montage edits, and uh, see you next time.